What's going on you guys? Today we're going to show you how to get the material test array back in version 2.0.8. A lot of people don't know that it moved over to toolbox on the left hand side. So make sure you cl click toolbox, material test array. There's currently a glitch right here with the length and width. The minimum is 10. You can change that to 10 on both of these. And right there it's good to go. You can increase the size of it from there uh, as big as you want. Let's say you like something like that. And then you can increase or decrease your maximum power or minimum power. Let's say we want our minimum power to be uh, higher than 10. We'll increase that to like 20 here. And you can see all the numbers automatically change so they're evenly spread out. So now we're going 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Uh, for the power, you can increase or decrease the number of rows if you want to. So let's say we only want four rows. Um, you can do the same thing with the speed. Let's say we want the max speed to be 500. So we're getting it a little bit more dialed in here. Uh, we can reduce the amount of rows for that or increase it as well. And let's say we're so happy with something like that. You can mess around with the spacing if you want to. You can make them tighter together, further apart, etc. I think you guys get the point. You click on confirm and you now have your material test array. This is already pre-set up in all the settings, so 500 speed will be over here, this entire row, and then 100 power would be this entire row here, so 500 by 100 would be this square. It's automatically set for the settings for you. Print this off on any material that you want to do. Uh, watch it, make sure no fire starts. If you get a fire, stop it, and then change these settings so it's more appropriate, and retest it with a new uh, material test array. Um, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys haven't joined the We Create Users group, check that out or any of our other groups. I'll put a link down in the description below and we'll catch you guys in the next one.